what is going on everybody? It's the Hands for Gamer. Welcome back to one of the Madden video. Hope you're a fantastic day. This video will be checking out what's new with the fan appreciation promo. I don't think there's much new. I think there's just new packs and new challenges, but still we're gonna be checking all that out. And you guys actually get a free golden ticket player of your choice. So let me know down in the comment section below who are you gonna pick for your free golden ticket for me? I have no idea. But please do subscribe, like, comment, and put notifications on if you new because I do upload two Madden videos every single day. I upload Madden content, Madden tips, and Madden coin making methods. Sony support would mean a lot because I do put a lot of time into my videos. But anyways, let's get right into it and let's see if any of the stuff are out yet. Well, the challenges aren't in yet, but the packs are in. Let's see, what are the odds of this? So 100% chance to give you an 86 overall, 43% chance to give you a 93 overall. Sadly, you're going to have to pull probably a 90, probably a 94 or a 95 overall every time to make your coins back. So you probably have like a 40% chance to make your coins back, which isn't that bad compared to everything else. So while we wait for the challenges to up here, we'll just open a few of these packs. And yeah, so draft player, we get an 86 Calvin Ridley. Wow, we only get three slots in this pack. That is terrible. That was absolutely terrible. You're only gonna give us three slots, EA. That is like, wow. I thought, usually usually these fan appreciation packs in the past, man, they give you five slots. But Ultimate Legend, we get 94 Jim Brown. Uh, draft, we get another 86 Damaris Randall. And we get an NFL 100 Centennial. 95 Randy Moss, holy crap, let's freaking go. That was a good pack right there. So apparently the first pack was just uh, terrible. But we got three of these packs left to go. I mean, you know, to be honest, I kind of expected, you know, really good packs out of these. And uh, you have a chance to lose a lot of coins from these packs, like I'm about to right here. Yep, like if you guys get a pack like this, that's absolutely terrible. You're, you guys are going to lose like 35,000 coins. Usually these fan appreciation packs, you like make coins more than you guys lose coins, but I cannot say the same about these packs. Big Ultimate Legend, 97 Lawrence Taylor, that is a huge pull right here. But like you guys can put, you guys can pull people like that, like Lawrence Taylor and make a lot of your coins back. Or you guys can get unlucky like I did with my first couple of packs and not pull anybody. But 92 Julian Akawara. <laughs> All right, so we definitely made our coins back on that one, so I will definitely not uh, complain about that one. And we have one more of these packs left to go. Should you guys buy these? I think you guys should definitely buy these, but just stay on guard that you guys will probably lose some coins. But uh, Small Legend Peach right here, 86 Patrick Sertain. Draft Player, we get 86 Darnell Savage. All right, so this is a pack that you guys could get if you guys could open the fan appreciation packs, or you guys could get a 97 Lawrence Taylor. So looks like it's boomer bust that's what these packs look like but all right so those are the fan appreciation packs you guys can pay twenty dollars for five fan appreciation packs so anything else new they got rid of the 87 plus draft player pack which kind of led me to believe that they were going to get rid of that they were going to uh, bring a new promo out but i was not expecting fan appreciation but let's see if the challenges are in yet so it doesn't look like the challenges are in yet. So, so far right now, all we have are the packs. I'll see you guys once the challenges are here. All right, I forgot this is also a pack opening video. So I guess while we wait for the new challenges, I'll, I'll open some packs. Usually I don't do these type of videos where I, com where I combine content and pack opening at the same time. So I'm not used to it, but we'll just get rid of the pack opening first and see what we can pull while we wait for the new challenges to come out. So Pow Pow Lee Market and 90 overall draft player. And I hope EA doesn't delay the content again. Most likely, EA did delay the content. We'll probably only spend a million coins. We've already spent 250k, so we'll spend 750k more worth of packs. Ultimate Legend 90, John Rand. All right, we will definitely take that. All right, so that was pretty terrible, to be honest. Uh, I'm gonna let's open some game change packs. Well, we'll go in between. We'll open some game change packs and we'll open some elite player packs. So usually these game changer packs aren't too good for me. Usually they just give me a bunch of low elites. Yeah, like this one right here. Look at this. This is all under 85 overall. So I don't really like opening game changer packs. So I'm just going to stick to elite player packs for now. Because these, these packs have a chance to give you something good. So 84 Adam Vinatieri. Uh, we should get another elite. Flashback we get... 90 Alshon Jeffrey. Does this guarantee you 90? Because we've gotten a 90 overall in every single pack. It gives you at least an 86 overall. So, all right. So, 4% chance to give you 96 plus. So, we should have a 2% chance to pull one of these golden tickets. 
probably like a 0.5% chance honestly to pull a golden ticket which is honestly sad considering they should have boosted odds but they don't because you know EA wants us to wants to lie to us to uh, uh, open these packs up 86 to our app key 85 all right that was actually a pretty good pack right there so we got about four of these packs left to go so we'll just finish off these packs and open a few game trainer packs to end the rest of the video because literally i've spent probably four million coins i've not pulled a single golden ticket and i've seen a lot of people spend like 10 million coins are you kidding me big x and you give me an 87 overhaul but all right let's see what else we get that's probably our only elite right yeah that was a terrible pack but like I've spent like probably 5 million coins on packs and not pulled a single freaking golden ticket. Like that is absolutely terrible. They l really need to boost the odds. They need to make pack openings fun again. And they also need to lower the prices of some of these packs. Because like an ultimate legend pack for 180,000 coins. You guys literally need to pull a 90, not even a 97 overall. Just think about that. A 97 overall goes for 90, about 90,000 coins. So you have to pull two ninety-seven overalls in a single pack of ultimate, and then two ninety-seven overalls in an ultimate legend pack to make your coins back, which is absolutely insane. Not even to make profit, but just to make your coins back. So draft player, we get ninety-one Terrell Lewis. That's a good pull right there. Probably didn't make our coins back, but I think they need to reduce it to at least one hundred twenty thousand coins, maybe even ninety thousand coins, because the ultimate legend prices are way too high. So team of the week, we get Shaq Barrett, Elite Telvin Smith, Big X, we get 89 Randall Cunningham. Every time I get a Big X, man, it's always terrible. Every freaking time. All right, so those are all of our Elite Player Packs. So we'll open four more of these game stream packs, and that should add up to about a million coins. So heavyweight, we get 86 Yannick Ngakwe, 85 Frank Gore, 85 Jerry Rice. All right, so this wasn't that bad, but you know, we kind of really need to pull we need to pull an average of 10,000 coins per uh, card so that would be about an 89 overall we need to pull at least an 89 overall in every single slot all right d2 small legend draft player 86 overall probably no nope, 92 zach bond that's actually a pretty good pull right there veterans 86 k matthews and super bowl player 82 Corey clement all right so we might have made our coins back with that 92 uh, overall right there so we'll open two more of these packs. So not the greatest pack opening. You know, you don't really get a great pack opening unless you pull a golden ticket. All right, so that wasn't that great. And our final game changer pack. Let's see what we can get. 90 Charles Clay, that's not bad. 86 Isaiah McKenzie, uh, Football Outsider. 89 Noah fan. All right. Well, that is the end of our pack opening. Not the greatest, but not the worst. We did pull 97 Lawrence Taylor after fan appreciation packs. So we actually might have made our coin packs. I'm pretty sure that is probably going for like two, maybe 300,000 coins, hopefully. All right. So the fan appreciation cha challenges are here. Uh, we, as you guys can see, you guys can get an 87 overall Nat. A 90 overall nat theme builder too and then you guys get your 99 overall nat golden ticket player and it's a fantasy pack so you guys can choose any golden ticket player of your choice only bad thing is you guys will have to wait three weeks for this thing so you have to complete all the week one challenges and then once week two comes out you guys will be able to complete all the week two and then week three you guys will be able to finally get your golden ticket so you guys won't be able to get your golden ticket until may 29th so let me know down in the comment section below who are you guys gonna pick and also i will be doing a 1200 sub giveaway so let me know who do you guys think should be in the giveaway but if you guys have enjoyed this video please do like subscribe comment and put notifications on for you because i do upload two man videos every single day for man content man tips and man coin make methods so any support would mean a lot because i do put a lot of time into my videos thank you guys for watching i'm the hands for gamer love god without your heart mind soul strength and to love your neighbors as yourself god bless flush hands stay home stay safe peace